1710, George Cadman conveyed to Mary Hicks Land on the riverfront where she used as a ferry landing in a home. In 1735, she sold the property to her son, William, who started to build a bridge that was completed in 1738. The bridge was built because people went to cross the river. The roads ran from either side. In 1739, the General Corps permitted him to establish the bridge they had constructed as a toll bridge. In 1743, he was allowed to double the tolls because of the cost of building and taking care of the bridge. The rates of the toll bridge depended on what you wanted to cross over. The rates were a single passenger was one penny, every horse and man was two pennies, every horse or cow was one penny, every score of sheep or hogs, five pennies per score. The year that Westport started to own the bridge was in 1871. The town of Westport took the bridge and abolished the toll feature.